most of you have problems with the card swipe task. Sometimes it's too fast, or sometimes it's too slow. So here's a solution. Take the card and quickly swipe it left and right three to four times. That's it. The admin map is one of the best features of the game. Here's an example. You can see one player in the electrical. Now there's two. The blink suggests that a player has been finished. Now the body gets reported instantly. So you can clearly say that it was a self-report. Here's a side-by-side -side visual of what happened. Here's a small detail which you can notice. The tasks in Medbay are towards the right side, so if someone walks out after doing the task, they'll face towards their left. Whereas the vents inside the Medbay are towards the left side, so if an imposter walks out of a vent, he'll face towards the right. Do not instantly call for a meeting, just keep an eye on the suspect. As soon as a game starts, if you see someone doing this upload task inside the admin room, they are 100% faking the task. This is because, firstly, the file needs to be downloaded. Only then can it be uploaded. There are five different download locations on the map, which are the cafeteria, weapons, navigation, communication, and electrical. Whereas there is only one upload location, which is inside the admin room. If you're an imposter and you see that the taskbar is about to get full, call for a comm sabotage. By doing this, the crewmates won't be able to see their tasks until they fix it. The tasks won't be visible on the map, too. By sabotaging the comms, the cameras, as well as the admin map, also become unusable. Most of you find it difficult to fix this. Here's a quick and simple solution. Just rotate the knob slowly towards the left and right. Pay attention to this light. Wherever the light goes off, that's the point. So adjust the knob exactly where the light went off. Here's an example in real time. Here's a 200 IQ trick. Suppose you and your imposter partner finish two crewmates together. One of you quickly go and call for an emergency meeting. By doing this, the bodies get disappeared and the crewmates will never know where they actually finished. Now simply say that you suspect someone, but you're not sure. Eventually they'll skip and you'll remain safe. If someone sees you come out of a vent, they'll straight away run to call a meeting. Use the vent to go faster and stay ready to finish them before they call for a meeting. Here's one more situation. You can also close the gate of the room to trap them inside and finish them. Suppose you're walking alongside someone and they suddenly stop. Now, if a sabotage occurs, it's most likely done by them. So whenever you're an imposter, never stay idle while sabotaging. Always keep sprinting while you sabotage. Here's a good way to catch the imposter by looking at the vents from a different room. So here's a vent. Now look carefully. As you can see, the vent opened. So we'll quickly go towards the room and check who it was. Now quickly call for a meeting. Here's one more example. If you're in the security room and see a vent open in the med bay, instantly open the cameras to see who goes out of the med bay. Now you know who the imposter is. This model inside the reactor is a dummy model. This task is just for show and can't actually be done. So if you see someone faking this, they're 100% the imposter. If you're an imposter, never pretend to fake a task for a long time without knowing it. For example, this task. It hardly takes two to three seconds to complete it. 
so if you stand there for too long, they can easily predict that you're the imposter. The best tasks to fake as an imposter are the download task, the refueling task, and the wire fixing task. All of these are two-step tasks, so you don't need to worry about the taskbar. If someone sabotages and turns off the light, you can still go to the security room and watch the cameras to see everything clearly with full lights. Whenever you're doing a visual task, wait until someone comes near you. If they see you doing a visual task, they'll be sure that you're not an imposter and they can vouch for you during the meetings. Here's a fun trick. If you finish someone, you can quickly stand in front of his body and align yourself so that anyone walking around won't know about it. If you enjoyed watching this and want a part 3 of the video, make sure you subscribe and hit the like button. Let's keep a like game of 100k. Hope you guys do it.